What is up guys, Rice Vlogs back with another video. Thanks for clicking on the link and checking things out. So as you guys just seen a second ago, I am here at my local Walmart. We're going to pick out some things just to make cruising with the boys a little easier. Um, it's something that we kind of came up with recently where we were like, you know what, why not roll with some walkie talkies because it's definitely one of them things where, you know, you're either using your phone to try to like text quick or, you know, call them up or anything, but you really can't talk to everyone at once, obviously. So like, we were kind of brainstorming, like walkie-talkies just kind of seemed like the move. You know, we were talking like CB radio, stuff like that, but we don't want to have to goof around with like antennas and running CBs, and like people don't really do that no more. So it's like, why not just do handheld? We're used to that. Just get some walkie-talkies. Some of us can, you know, keep them, just hang on to them, always have them in our cars. So we always got them. So it's one of the things where it's like kind of a no-brainer. Go get some walkie-talkies. That way, you know, when we're cruising and one of the guys says like, hey, let's make a stop quick, whatever. You can just radio through to everybody and you're done. So I'm at the Walmart quick. I'm going to go see what they got. Hopefully I can get, you know, some mid-range, like decent price, but still, you know, good quality. Um, probably pick up four for now and then I'll know where to get more if I need to get more, of course, because Walmart's going to have them. But um, yeah, so I'm bringing you guys with today. We're just kind of doing some odds and ends like that. I want to get some more camera gear type stuff too because... Um, right now I'm just using you know the camera how it is or like a gorilla pod or something But then I always have to worry about you know stability and things like that the camera does have built-in stability to a point But it's not perfect. It's still gonna be shaky things like that So if I can kind of complement the built-in stability with some other out, you know outsourced Stability of some sort then I'm gonna look into that. It's just hard because I look online and there's tons of different types of you know stabilizers those um I'm not sure what they're called, but they're like the handheld with the axis that moves, whatever they're called. I'm not sure. Um, but anyway, they make those two. But the price also is kind of a killer because some of them are, you know, three, four hundred dollars. I'm just looking to spend maybe like a hundred. So I'm trying to find something a little cheaper. Best Buy, unfortunately, doesn't have anything. Like they just, they're not even really stocked right now. I don't know what's going on with Best Buy. Maybe it's just by me. Maybe it's everywhere, but Best Buy is kind of a killer right now. They just don't have anything. They expect you to just go online and buy everything. So anyway, we're just going to kind of be on the lookout for things like that today too. But getting these walkie-talkies right now. So I'll hit you guys up when we get in the store. Alright guys, so I am back from going and getting these walkie-talkies, so they do seem kind of cheap. I mean, they're just like a hard plastic outside, some, you know, like rubber grippy buttons, um, plastic antenna, so they look kind of cheap, like toys almost. Then I was kind of reading into them more, you got 16 mile range, um, they're weatherproof, so that's nice of course. Um, and then the other thing that I was kind of iffy about was the fact that they're battery powered. Then I kind of was thinking about it, I'm like, well, let's be honest, like if guys are going to be leaving these in their cars, things like that, they're not going to get charged, um, like ever. So it'd be nice maybe to actually just have the batteries, because then it's like, if a guy's thing dies, it's like, all right, I got backup batteries, throw these in, you're good to go, you can just keep going with them. So it's like, you know, it's one of those things where if they were always dying, you know, because they're not charged or anything like that, then, you know, we're going to have to not have them basically and they're going to become useless so it's like it's better to just probably have the batteries actually because then we can just actually uh you know always keep backup batteries and just make sure always uh guys always got juice to keep going so not too bad they're like almost 30 bucks uh for the two sets so it was about 60 for both um like i said i ended up getting four so now you know 
I can always have one and then I got one for three other homies so we're gonna be set up there um, you know because typically if we're going out for a smaller cruise or anything you know four guys that's plenty um, even if a couple guys are missing out at least you know most of the guys can communicate I'll probably get more later but it's like I'm not gonna just buy it you know a ton of them and then always have everybody having one or whatever so anyway this will do good for now um, that way we can kind of test them out too and nice thing with Walmart they're pretty forgiving so honestly if we don't like them things break we can just return them so not a huge deal um, I was I wasn't gonna get them because I was like I don't know they seem kind of cheap you know they they just didn't seem like the greatest option and then for 26 bucks I'm like I don't know that's probably decent but it's also kind of pricey for how they look things like that but I'm just gonna try them see how they work um, honestly I might even test them like set it on the ground maybe put my phone there and record and then like drive like a good distance away and make sure it still works it says it's got 16 mile range we'll see but it's like you know cars obviously are getting some distance between them often so it's like you know we're not always you know only a vehicle away from each other there is times where you're gonna have a guy you know a mile away from each other so just kind of one of them things we'll see how it works um, obviously we always have our phones too but it's just nice to rely on these a little more so we can be safer because honestly you hit a button and talk is a lot safer than pulling up a phone you know scrolling through that nobody wants to text and drive so this is definitely a lot better option so we got that secured um, I might swing by Best Buy just to see what kind of camera stuff they got yet see if there is anything that I could use um, I could use some more SD card stuff like that so we're gonna go to Best Buy now and then uh, yeah so I'll, I'll get you guys when we get there Alright guys, so we're here at Best Buy. Unfortunately, they don't open for um, about three or four minutes. So we just gotta wait a couple minutes in the car. We're a little early, but that's alright. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna see if they have some kind of like stabilizers here. Um, and I also wanna see if there's some stuff that I can get for like mounting the camera in the car a little better, you know, so I can get some like driving. Um, stuff like that maybe you know even just to have like the camera off to the side while I'm driving and I can be talking to you guys because that's kind of when I do like most of my thinking honestly and like when I'm actually coming up with ideas or just wanting to like you know have something to uh, say is when I'm driving so like this is kind of the best spot for me at times too is just to be able to talk to you guys while I'm driving so I want to see if there's some stuff that I can find uh, I guess we'll see because otherwise I'm gonna have to get creative with the gorilla pod you know try to hang it from like the rear view you know stuff like that so you know it might work having it up here from the rear view but sometimes it's kind of not the best shot either um but yeah we'll kind of see you know i'm not too sure what they're gonna have like i said they might not have much of anything but i'm here i got a little bit of extra time so i'm gonna go check it out so All right guys, so I'm back yet again. We just got done at Best Buy and uh, I ended up actually getting a stabilizer. They only had like a few of them, uh, a couple for iPhones or smartphones I should say. And then they had a couple for cameras. One of them was like close to $600. I wasn't gonna spend that on a stabilizer. That's more than half of what I paid for my camera. So I'm not doing that. But I did end up picking up this one here. It is a Ronin SC um, from DJI or DJI sorry so um I don't know anything about this brand or anything but it looks pretty legit not gonna lie so I just went through with it I'll try it out if it doesn't work out I'll return it no big deal um I don't know much about stabilizers in general but that's all part of this I'm trying to learn you know try to get the equipment and try to learn with it and grow with it because that's all part of it is just get it and kind of grow with it and um eventually the content will slowly get better because I'm gonna slowly learn more and more about everything so of course, you know, I, I just figure most stabilizers are going to be up there in price. Um, even looking online, I couldn't find any for, 
you know, less than two or $300 anyway. So I just ended up getting this one because it's readily available. Now, if I have issues, I can just come to Best Buy and return it or whatever needs to be done. Um, so I'm pretty excited though for this. So I'm going to take it out right now and just kind of experiment with it and try some things. So you guys are coming for the first couple shots with it. Um, I'm not sure what to expect out of this package for sure, but it looks like it comes with a buttload of stuff. So I'm going to start unpackaging it once I get to a spot to shoot some pics. And uh, yeah, let's see what we can do. See you in the next.